Subscribe to Witchtube if you love tech as tech is what I review on this channel. This is an all-day 24-hour strap-free heart rate monitor that also accurately measures ECG and in this video I'm going to talk about this device as well as test its reading out. Now in terms of price this strap-free heart rate monitor also known as visual beat heart rate monitor is listed on getvalue.com for only $68.99 US dollar. However, you get extra 10% off not just on this but any product from Value's website if you were to use the discount code WITSTUBE or simply click the link in the video description. Now it came in a box like this one. Inside the box you'll find the Visual Beat heart rate monitor, a charger, a chest strap and 15 piece disposable electrodes. I don't really know what will you do with that one electrode that remains due to this odd number. Finally, there is a warranty card and a user manual. Now the Visual Beat heart rate recorder itself is very lightweight and compact. In fact, it's the same size, weight and dimension as this AI ECG recorder, which will cost you 296 US dollar. So obviously you would wonder why there is a huge price difference. Well, let me explain you first thing first this AI ECG recorder even though it's about the same in terms of looks it has AI analysis that would auto detect the ECG recording for up to 24 hours and detect 14 different kind of abnormal ECG events and generate a detailed report with the help of the free PC or Mac app which can be very resourceful to your medical doctor and I have done a full video of this AI ECG recorder linked at the end of this video. Be sure to check it out if you want to learn more about this. But this Visual Beat heart rate monitor is primarily for heart rate monitoring. It can only record 24 hour heart rate. It can accurately detect and record ECG but only for a maximum of 30 minutes. And there is no AI ECG analysis available. More to it later during the video. Now in terms of design, the Visual Beat heart rate monitor consists of two parts with electrode attachment site. Both these parts are connected by a flexible joint. At the front, the right side is marked distinctly and highlighted. On the left side, there is an LED indicator where flashing green means on standby mode, flashing orange means low battery, steady orange means charging and no light means battery is depleted or the device is turned off. At the back there are a few printed details with the electrode attachment and these four pins are the charging contact points. Speaking of charging, this Visual Beat heart rate monitor has a rechargeable lithium ion battery which can record continuously for 48 hours when fully charged and it takes about 2-3 to three hours to fully charge. Now in terms of specs, just pause this video and read through all this specs list. Now the charger has a USB type A on one end which goes into the wall adapter that is not included or you can use a power bank or plug it into your PC to charge this device up. Unlike the AI ECG recorder, this Visual Beat heart rate monitor cannot be connected to a PC or a Mac. The only way to access the recording is through the mobile application. This clip is quite robust and durable. You can't go wrong with placing the Visual Beat recorder in the charging. There is a cutout on top to see the LED indicator. So with all that said, let's talk about the application process. There are two ways to attach this Visual Beat heart rate monitor on your chest. If you are using this sticky adhesive electrode which literally contains gel pad, you can apply it on your chest as shown in this image. Either vertically on your chest bone or horizontally right under the chest bone. Now, if you are a guy with manly hairs like me, which by the way I am not going to show on this video, try to use this chest strap instead, the adhesive electrodes, for more data accuracy and to save yourself from the pain while taking off these adhesive electrodes. As shown earlier, this chest strap is included inside the box. This chest strap is machine washable but make sure to detach the visual beat heart rate monitor before the wash. Now the strap free visual heart rate monitor is very easy to attach. Make sure to place the labeled right side on your right side or else the ECG graph will be inverted. Place the chest strap as shown in this image. To wrap the chest strap around it's very easy. You can do it all by yourself with just sliding the sleeve inside the hook attachment and I'm sure it can be done with two hands without any help and very quickly. You can even adjust the strap length from this buckle. 
Now at the back of the electrode attachment there is a rubber pad which is basically the electrode itself. One very important point over here is you have to moisten the electrodes with clean water or else the readings won't be detected instantly. Now let me go ahead and place it on my chest and show you guys the reading on the mobile vHealth app. This vHealth app is available for free both on Apple App Store and Android Play Store. Once you have activated the visual beat heart rate uh, monitor as prompted on the app, you'll be able to see the visual beat in the connected device list. Click on it and you will be able to see the real time data under the dashboard. Under settings you can set the target heart rate zone. Other setting includes device update, factory set, heartbeat sound and others. Under history you will find the recorded data. This data is easily distinguished by the ECG icon. Any data that has this ECG icon will be the ECG data. This ECG data can be manually recorded from the dashboard when you press this record ECG. For your information, the ECG data can be only up to a maximum of 30 minutes. Once you click stop, the data will be stored under the history tab. When you access the ECG data, you can add notes, check the time, average heart rate and even export it as a PDF for your doctor to interpret the ECG recording as unlike the AI ECG recorder there is no AI to interpret the ECG recording for you. But having the ability to get the ECG recording itself is a great option to have. You can even expand the ECG graph to view it horizontally in case if you want to go through each segment of the recorded ECG. From my testing and comparison of the ECG recording from this visual beat heart rate monitor versus the AI ECG recorder, they both are pretty good even when you're exercising. I recently reviewed their Pulsebeat EX ECG recorder which will cost 119 US dollar. With this, you can only record a 5 minute maximum of ECG recording and there is no AI to interpret the collected data. But from my testing, it is not so great at dynamic ECG recording that is during the exercises. If you want to learn more about this device, check out the review video linked at the end. So for ECG recording during exercise or dynamic activities, I would highly recommend this visual beat heart rate monitor and to further quantify the ECG recording I would recommend this AI ECG recorder. I have also compared the ECG reading of this visual beat heart rate monitor against the Apple Watch Series 7 and in my opinion it outperforms Series 7 with ECG monitoring especially during exercises. Now let's talk about the heart rate monitoring which is what this device is primarily intended to do. Let's compare the heart rate reading of this visual beat heart rate monitor against the heart rate recording from this Apple Watch. And you can see it's pretty accurate. Not just that, from my testing I'm quite surprised that it's even accurate during high intensity workouts like running on a treadmill, weightlifting etc. From my testing, this visual beat heart rate monitor has better accuracy to all the premium smartwatches that I have reviewed on this channel. So hands down for $69, this is a perfect heart rate monitor during any form of activity or rest. I have even tested it for nighttime heart rate monitoring and it's very accurate. It's even better than the reading from this O2 ring which is also by value and its review video is linked up in the card section. You can check it out once you're done watching this one. However, this O2 ring as the name implies is for measuring the blood oxygen and it does great at measuring O2 sets. You can even access and export the heart rate monitoring chart where it also shows the maximum and an average heart rate recording with an interactive graph which you can pinch zoom in and out and move to a specific event. It also shows motion graph which you can pinch zoom to compare it against those heart rate spikes. So overall the heart rate data is on par with premium smartwatches and even other health monitoring devices. And the cherry on top is unlike the Polar H10 heart rate sensor, this value visual beat heart rate monitor will also accurately check and record the ECG data. Being a registered physiotherapist myself and with my knowledge of cardiology and putting this device to a test with all these readings, I have seen that for most part this device does what it is intended for. Certainly this cannot substitute a diagnosis from a medical doctor and this device is not a 12 lead ECG but it can be an adjunct and a good resource. 
So here are my final thoughts. For 69 US dollar, this is a great device. It's super easy to use. It comes with all that you need to get started like the electrodes, chest strap, and even a free mobile app to store and access all the data. It's very easy to set up. The mobile app is very versatile with multiple ways to export the readings. Wearing the chest strap continuously is non-obstructive and you can easily get used to it. The drawback of this device is you cannot record ECG longer than 30 minutes and there is no AI to interpret the reading. But hey, for these enhanced features, there is an AI ECG recorder which does a great job even at a 24 hour ECG recording obviously for more money. So if your goal is to accurately track all day heart rate for exercise and rest along with the ability to record a short 30 minute ECG and save it for your doctor to have a look. I bet you won't regret spending the money on this Visual Beat strap free heart rate monitor. That is it with this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Hit that like button as it will help out my channel a lot and consider subscribing. Also check out this video if you want to step up the ECG recording as you can't beat this AI ECG recorder in terms of ECG recordings.